नमस्ते लेटस एक्सप्लोर द रिलेशनशिप बिटवीन अवर हैंड एंड मिनिट हैंड विथ द हेल्प ऑफ गियर्स इन एन अर्लियर वीडियो वी डिस्कस सम की फीचर्स ऑफ गियर्स लाइक डायरेक्शन गियर रेशो कंपाउंड गियर एंड सो ऑन टुडे वी विल यूज दीज फीचर्स टू मिमिक टू क्लॉक मोमेंट्स अवर हैंड एंड मिनिट हैंड Deciding about the gear ratios is the key to proper functioning of the clock. With one complete rotation of the minute hand, that is 60 minutes, the hour hand moves one hour. In terms of degrees, for every 360 degree movement of the minute hand, the hour hand moves 30 degrees. We need to design for the reduction ratio of 12 is to 1 between the two hands. to begin with we can just design this with two gears 12 teeth gear for the minute hand and 144 teeth gear for the hour hand or it could be 10 teeth for the minute hand gear while 120 teeth for the hour hand gear but gears with 144 teeth or 120 teeth are too large to create and manage as well we will have to break it down to the manageable number Another constraint is the gears available with us. Here we have blue colored gear with 12 teeth, yellow colored gear with 18 teeth and red colored gear with 24 teeth. With these we can build a compound gear. Our goal will be to achieve one rotation of the our hand for every 12 rotations of the minute hand. Let us factor number 12 so that we can work with smaller ratios. 6 into 2 is 12 further we can break it down into 3 into 2 into 2 that is 12 reduction ratio of 2 can be achieved with the help of two gears 12 teeth and 24 teeth but it is not possible to get the reduction ratio of 3 with the help of available gears we will need 12 teeth gear and 36 teeth gear which we don't have let's break it further down we can rewrite this equation with 1.5 into 2 as well that means we will have two sets of compound gears one with the reduction ratio of 1.5 while other with the reduction ratio of 2 as you know we have gears with 12 18 and 24 teeth number 12 has good divisibility with the help of 12 and 18 teeth gear we can achieve the ratio of 1.5 while with the help of 12 and 24 teeth we can achieve the ratio of 2 we will start with this simple test setup this gear will be our minute hand motion can be transferred from one gear to another like this let us introduce the pair one by one with this setup for one rotation of the minute hand we have the expected movement of 30 degrees for the hour hand but with a small issue they are not in the same direction with an even number of axles from start to finish we get a change in direction with an odd number of axles we get the same direction in our case it is 7 with basic test done it's time to assemble it together like a real clock that means the axle driving the hour hand will contain the axle driving the minute hand with the help of this bevel gear mechanism we can drive our clock very easily with this setup it's time to install dial and test our system hope this activity will help you to build similar mechanisms thank you